This plastic bottle, the chasing arrows are on the bottom of it. It should be recycled. How about this? We have some chasing arrows on the bottom of this. We should be recycling this. Of course, more boxes, recycling. Metal cans, definitely. Look at the chasing arrows right there. Need to be recycled. Big boxes, definitely recycled. Pizza boxes, come on. This, it, whoa, that shouldn't be recycled. Ugh. Anyhow, milk cartons. They should not be here in the landfill. They should be put in our recycle bins. All right, it's time to get dirty, disgusting, filthy. In fact, it's time to talk some trash. And I'll tell you why. <laughs> I'm Joel Green, and welcome to Curiosity Quest Goes Green, the show that explores what you're curious about. And today, our dirty quest letter comes to us from Jeff in Hawaii. He wrote, Dear Joel, does somebody take all the recycled products out of the landfill, or do they just stay in the landfill and turn into pollution? Well, aloha, Jeff. And because of you, we are out here at a Victorville landfill where we're going to take this dirty question and find a clean answer on today's Curiosity Quest Goes Green. somebody to talk trash with me, Mr. Brooks Webb. How's it going, man? Good, how are you, Joel? Good, good. So tell us, what is your job here and what are we standing in front of? Well, I'm a public works operations supervisor and uh, for the County of San Bernardino, solid waste management. And we oversee the operation of the landfills and transportations throughout the county. We are at uh, the Victorville Sanitary Landfill in Victorville, California. What is a landfill? A bunch of trash piled somewhere. A landfill is a place where all the trash goes. When you throw away like those bags or Coca-Cola's, things like that, instead of recycling, it goes to the landfill, which is a lot of land. It could, it can fill like the Dodger Stadium in just a few days. Where they burn all the cans. A place where you put recycling, where you put plastic at or something. Now, what exactly is a landfill? Well, a landfill is where uh, the trash comes uh, from your curbside. Curbside collection comes by, picks it up when you put it out on the street. And uh, it comes here to us, and it's dumped on the ground. We go through it, we pull out what recyclables we can, and, and the residual material, the trash, ends up being buried at the end of the day. So is this the only place where trash ends up going? For the most part in California, most of the trash ends up in a landfill. Um, there are some areas where they do some incineration where they actually burn the waste, but that, that they don't do much of that in California. Most of it ends up here at the landfill. In a landfill. Okay. Now, are there a bunch of landfills in California? There's, yes, there's a whole bunch. <laughs> We've got six of them just here within the county that are active working right now. Oh my goodness. And is this one of the largest ones? This is our second largest one. Second largest one. All right. But I understand you have a pretty re uh, active recycling process here. Yeah, right? we do. Yeah. All right. We're going to check it out. Sure. You Let's do it. Teach us how to... Uh, Talk trash, huh? You bet. Let's uh, do it. Uh, let's go, man. All right. <laughs> fun fact. Fun fact. Fun fact. The U.S. is the number one trash producing country in the world at 1,609 pounds per person per year. This means that 5% of the world's people generate 40% of the world's waste. My goodness, we need to be better at this. Once trash is picked up at the street uh, and the truck brings it here, what's the process they have to go through? Well, when they come in, they're going to come on one of our, our three scales here. We have three scales here. They're 70 feet long, so we can we can weigh with the big 18-wheeler trucks on here. When they come in, we weigh them, and most of the big trucks, we already have a weight on them, an empty weight. 
So when they come in, we weigh them, we can tell exactly how much is in there, and we charge by the ton here. Uh, is just uh, trash trucks that bring stuff here? No, um, private people come in, uh, just homeowners. We, we get stuff, pickup trucks, uh, down to little cars, and then 18-wheelers. <laughs> like right <laughs> yeah, we get guys like this all the time. 